we just pushed it out. Now we're gonna start it, let it run for a little bit again. If we're lucky, if everything's seeming stable, we might try putting this thing into the gear for the first time today, seeing if it goes forward and back, and if it does, maybe we can get it on the road for its first drive in 20, 30 years. Let's see what happens. Okay, give it a try. Foot on, foot on the brake? Yep. Oh, there we go. Yep, give it a try again. Pump it like crazy. Whoops, 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 you got a spark going here. Something on the solenoid. Okay, it's it's a dirty connection on this part of the solenoid. Oh. This big cable here is sparking. Yeah, we did. I think it's ready for a little bit longer drive here.
Okay, we've successfully made it back from our first two drives. First drive just around the block, not going fast. Made it home, shut it off, restarted it. So then we got daring and we took it to the gas station and filled it up with gas. Made it home just fine. Of course, before we went to pull it in, it was smelled gas and we looked underneath and yeah, had some gas dripping. Well, just had a loose hose clamp and the rubber fuel line wasn't pushed on the metal nipple all the way, so correct that, no more gas dripping. It's a happy first day on the road. First day since before 2000, I believe. There it is. First time driving into the garage, not pushing it, but driving it. Let's see what happens. everyone for watching this was a huge milestone getting this on the road so now we can finalize the de little details get the brake lights working stop the horn from honking all the time we did take this on a second drive to the gas station filled it up yeah and that white smoke that was coming out the other day it was not happening today maybe just a tiny bit of it but yeah we'll have to keep an eye see if that comes back but right now it's looking good so thanks for watching and subscribe.